afternoon. Um, just how this whole thing got started for me, I was watching Face the State with a former uh, DMV commissioner on there, and Dennis House, who's a big Whalers fan, asked him, um, what do we got to do to get Whalers license plates? So he explained the whole signature process, and he said, or a state legislator can introduce a bill. So I tweeted to him, uh, I'll do it. And that's kind of how it got started. I got in touch with um, Joanne from the Booster Club and the Whalers guys, um, Jerry and Pete. And they worked really hard behind the scenes, and that's probably what you don't hear about the most. They did the legwork on getting the signatures. They got the fan support out there. They do cable access shows. So I just kind of helped them along the way. Um, it has been about two and a half years since we started that, originally starting with the signature process. And then we decided um, last year I just submitted the bill. And I want to thank, again, like uh, Representative Ritter said, um, they got a lot of, it was very bipartisan. Um, with everybody here in this room, and um, it's a great cause. Uh, my kids have been at this hospital, um, and, and they've received great care. So, and, and again, I know I sound repetitive, but a big shout out to DMV. Um, there's a lot of, uh, you know, process to getting the NHL to agree and all that other things they had to do, and to do this in such a short amount of time and get this together, um, it's a true victory. And hopefully this is a sign of, you know, just how much support the Whalers have in Hartford, and maybe someday we'll get a team back. So thank you, and uh, we'll get a play.